to create a pinch pot monster. The first thing you're going to do when you get your block of clay is you're going to um, kind of smush it, knead it, flatten it to soften it up and make it workable. So once you have squished your clay up, what you're going to do is take a little chunk off and save that aside because this is going to be all the pieces of your monster. This part we are going to save to create a pinch pot. Now, first to make the pinch pot, this is going to be the base of the monster, the monster's body. You have to squeeze it and pull it into a ball and then roll it nice and smooth. Next, after your ball is rolled, take your thumb and push that into the center of your clay ball. Not all the way through, but most of the way through. You then pinch as you turn, and it's called a pinch pot because you're pinching it open. You have your pinch pot opened up. You have to decide if you want your monster mouth to be here. You can put eyes and a mouth here. Or if you want this to be the bottom and this to be the top. Now for my monster, I'm actually going to have this opening um, be open like this. And I'm going to be adding eyes onto the top. Before I start adding the pieces, I'm just going to smooth it out by dipping my fingers in slip water, which is clay water. smoothed out and I've shaped it into the mouth and ready to start adding things onto it. So I'm going to go with three eyeballs for my monster. I'm going to take three separate pieces of clay and roll them into balls. To add the pieces on you have to do what's called score and slip. To score and slip I take my fork and I make scratches in the surface of the clay where I'm going to stick the pieces and I dip my fingers in the slip water and rub it on the scratches. I can then put my piece directly and firmly onto the body of my monster. Okay, and now I have three eyeballs attached to my monster. I know I'm going to be painting these after I fire them, so I'm not going to poke any holes for the pupils. I'm planning on painting those after. I want to add some other details, like perhaps a tongue and some teeth. With the tongue, I need to do the same procedure of scoring and slipping. So first, I'm going to score in the mouth where I'm going to add the tongue. I'm going to add some slip, and I'm going to put the tongue in. I'm going to add some teeth. To add the teeth, I need to do the same thing, score and slip. There's a couple little feet. Now that I've scored and slipped everything on and made sure it's secure, I finish with my pinch pot monster and it's ready to be fired.
And if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe and like.